Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am bringing you um, something um, a little different, but it's for hair care. Well, my hair care. I'm going to move this thing because I need another holder for this, um, this tripod. So anyway, um, I am talking about flaxseed. Well, hopefully it won't jump off. Anyway, I'm talking about flaxseed, and I am going to be making flaxseed gel. And flaxseed, is it an herb? Yes, it's an herb um, that you can use for many different things, and you can also consume it. So, but today, I am talking about whole flaxseed, organic brown flaxseed. Now there are, um, I think there are like a couple of different shades of the flaxseed. I know what I have is brown. I've seen something like, they are basically brown, but it might have white. I'm not sure. But um, mine is brown, organic, vegan free, gluten free. So yeah, all those good things to start off. So. I'm going to read you guys just a little bit of some of the benefits of using flaxseed gel for your hair, not for consumption, just for your hair. So, um, yeah, I took just, I wasn't doing nothing with it anyway, so I just, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, so this is the benefits of flaxseed, the gel. So it is nourishing with nutrients like vitamin B, magnesium, selenium, and and copper, decreases inflammation. I guess that's... Okay. Uh, promotes hair growth. That's what we want, right? Well, that's what I want. Uh, it holds and defines. It gives you hold and definition. So I'm going to see about that. It strengthens, protects, moisturizes the hair, improves elasticity, uh, prevents breakage. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, helps prevent scalp conditions. I guess they mean like uh, over excessive itching or what is that other? Um, yeah. Whatever it's happening, it's happening with your scalp and you're having issues with it. This will help. Um, oh, they said like dandruff and itchy scalp. Okay, it's rich in antioxidants. Um, it repairs damaged hair follicles, prevents tissue corrosion. Okay, now flaxseed. It contains lignans, and um, lignans are poly polyphenols found in plants, a variety of plants and fruits. Okay, so that's just some of the benefits of the flaxseed. Um, so, um, this is, I purchased my flaxseed from where, you guys know, right, from Amazon. So, I purchased this, this is Food to Live, Food to Live, um, this is the bag I purchased, and it is eight pounds, uh, and they last for quite some time. They look like, I don't know what you would say this look like. Can you see that? <clears throat> oh, I have flaxseed all over everywhere. But they're little small seeds. But when you prepare them, they open up so all the goodness will come out. So um, how you make the gel is very simple. All you need is this. I mean the ingredients, all you need is that and water. That's it. So um, and you also you also are going to need a pot, a spoon, fork, whatever you choose, um, a strainer. Some people I've seen on uh, YouTube use stockings as just yeah, too messy for me. Um, the stockings, you know, have to put the gel in and squeeze it out. Yeah, you can do that with a strainer. I bought a strainer and um, 
specifically for this. Um, what else you're going to need? Uh, just a container to put it in. That's it. I bought a container for that too, but it has taken feet and walked. Yeah. Well, actually I bought two. It's two sets that I bought from a Dollar Tree. And yeah, it said, look for me. Because yeah, I can't find it nowhere. Uh, so anyway, they're probably, I don't know. Hopefully, because I had tied the bag, hopefully Rudy didn't come in here thinking it was trash. Took it and threw it away. The trash man has passed today already. <laughs> hopefully that's not the case. You know, I'm pretty sure I'm going to find it somewhere around here. So anyway, um, I'm going to make this flaxseed flex gel. Show you guys how I make it. And um, and then I'm going to uh, apply it and tell you guys a little bit more about it. I'm going to be using my other tripod for, um, I don't know, I, I have about four or five tripods. I'm going to be using my other tripod for, um, for this when I go in the kitchen. So, hold on. Hey guys, so I'm in the kitchen. The pot is on the fire. I was going to use my measuring cup that says one cup but this cup which is they're not the same size holds more so I just use a mug I use three cups of that and I'm going to use a half a cup of the uh, flexi I think the more flexi you use the thicker um, is going to be so I'm going to use half or another half see how that because this is my first time doing this so I'm this is trial and error right so I'm going to use a half I used a full cup before now I'm going to use a half put a half in there all right finish with that so now I'm just waiting for this to boil I have my strainer and container ready and also I have my fork ready as you can see it's starting to boil I don't want it to boil over so it's starting to boil I'm going to turn this fire down so that's what happens with electric stoves right so it's starting to boil and you're looking for the slimy consistency. And stir occasionally. So let me, I may have to turn this down a little more because it's going to keep boiling over. to stir it so all the seeds can work at the same time explode and get to work so it's still not there so let it boil for a little bit more okay so I've turned the fire off and this is the consistency that you would be looking for the gooey consistency so yeah <laughs> so what I'm going to do yeah that consistency <laughs> what I'm going to do now is strain it <laughs> now flax seeds are they are reusable 
that's totally up to you but they are reusable yeah these right here that's in the strainer I am going to use them again for to make more gel I'm just going to put them in the freezer to store them because you can't um, you can't leave flax seeds once they're you know they're cooked and stuff like that or used you can't leave them out you know sitting around on a counter or anything like that because they do they will go bad so I'm going to put these in the freezer until the next time I need to use it I'm just trying to get see if I can get all of the the gel out of here so maybe it not sure doesn't look like any more is coming out of there okay so the next thing is to let this cool like a little jelly form already yeah all right I'm gonna let that cool and I'll be back hey guys so I'm back and um the gel is cooler it's cool enough where I can you know stick my fingers excuse me in there so this is how it looks and this is the consistency of the gel it's gooey yes it's gooey now I'm not sure I guess it depends on a person's preference with the gel I'm trying to get it off my hand but I'm going to rub it in oh it feels nice I'm going to rub it in and I'm going to just put it on it's supposed to really define your curl I'm not the type that um like I've seen a lot of these videos I'm not the type who likes um tight curls I like loose curls so anyway I'm going to just grab it because this is how it looks and uh, start putting it in my hair nice and warm that's for sure You can also you can also put this on as um, use it in your conditioner. Um, I think I'm just going to to use it. I don't know if I put too much on or what. But um, I don't think there's no such thing as too much flax seed for your hair. But anyway, I'm going to put this on and see how it defines the curl pattern in my hair. I'm also going to massage it in. I'm not going to... Uh, do my whole head it is it's getting curly I'm not going to do my whole head my what <laughs> my whole whole head of hair I just want to show you guys how um, it looks and what it looks like after applying So, I don't know if, even if it does do the, you know, curl my hair up, I'm going to try to, like, sh keep it, it is curling it, but, see, these type of curls like this, I don't, I prefer not to have those type of, like, loose like this. So, yeah. But it is defining, defining, oh, I can't speak the, today. 
it is defining my curls it is because this is straight just like this was but they are curling up now yes they are so it works for that I've heard so many wonderful things about flaxseed for the hair you know you can always google it Yahoo it what is that uh, I haven't seen them they must have defunct Bing Bing it Bing yeah that was a, a search browser They must have folded. I do remember being. What happened to being? So okay. Now, if I want them, I want them looser. I probably would just have to separate them. They say that you know it does make your hair a little stiff after it dries, and um. You can just put some some oil or something um, on your hair. Flaxseed? No flaxseed. <laughs> it is defining, defining. Why do I keep saying that? It is defining my curls. It is. It is. I must admit to that. But that would mean, you know, that would be a long video. Seriously. Curl. If I did this whole big head, <laughs> and I would have to edit it, and I don't want to do that. I really don't. So I just wanted to show you guys. Let me do this side. How um, because I'm going to do my whole head. I am, but I'm just. I'm not going to put you guys through that. Oh, I'm not. But the uh, next time you probably see me, my hair will look like this because I am going to uh, be using it. I am. This is something I'm going to be doing like I did with the rice water. But I'm doing the flaxseed gel now. So it's like a challenge. Alright, I'm glad I said that because I want to... I'm going to stop... And um, measure my hair before I wet it all up. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to measure my hair. Tape measure right here. I haven't really did anything to my hair, really. I just put it in a bun and go. <laughs> That's it. <sighs> I've combed it on occasions. Yeah, but other than that, no, I haven't did anything to it. So, wait. This measurement is. I uh, can't do the top because I wet the top already. Okay, so anyway, on the sides. I guess it still should be what it was before when I was doing the rice water. Is that 12 inches? I don't think it was 12 inches. It may have grew. Who knows? Anyway, I'm going to measure the side. Okay. I'm going to measure the side. And since I can't measure the um the front i'm just going to measure the side and the back all right that is 12 inches for the side and the back well 
more or less the back, right? Okay. The back is also 12 inches. Do I have anything? Oh, I have something on the side, on this side. So, that's easy measurements to remember. What time is it? Oh, okay. Too, too damn long, girl. Too, too long. My grandbabies hear me say, damn. She said, they be saying, Mama, you curse. I say, damn, is in the Bible, girl. They don't know what I'm talking about. Because <laughs> they're not accustomed to me you know, saying ghoul language. That's what the Bible called cussing ghoul language. Okay, so. Ow, I'm pulling my hair. So it's 11 and, well, I'm still pulling. 11 and a half, 12 inches for this side also. So, okay, that's great, great. I can remember that. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys my curly hair. It is drying. So I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of my hair. Because I don't want one side, <laughs> one side curly and one side not, right? So anyway. I'm going to do this. This video is so long. I am so sorry. I may have to edit it anyway. I'm just not into editing. I'm just not. Um, but uh, I may have to because this is really long. Yeah, really long. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so very, very much for watching my video. And, you know, finding out if you don't know already about flaxseed if you don't know already so I just wanted to share that with you guys and share what I will be doing for the next probably oh I don't even know why I'm trying to pinpoint it it'll be at least a month or two maybe a month and a half somewhere in between there and I'll come back with a with an update to see the progress a lot of people put um, essential oils in their flaxseed gel I just want to see how it works on its own and um, you have to refrigerate it like I said you have to refrigerate it and it should last you it depends on how much you use and how frequently you use it I mean how much you make and how frequently you use it um, it should last um, I've heard some people say two or three weeks. I've heard some people say two or three months. Like I say, it depends on the frequency of you using it and how much you make. So from what I have in here, it should last me a while. So anyway, um, thank you guys so very, very much again. And for watching, I appreciate it. I really do. I hope you guys are having a great day. And um, thank you all so much for um, clicking on my video. You didn't have to, but I truly appreciate you doing so. And thank all my subscribers, my new subscribers, my OS. And I um, just appreciate you guys so very, very much. Love you guys. And I hope you all are having a wonderfully blessed day, living your best life. And I will see you. <laughs> I don't know what I look like, right? Ooh, look like a wild woman. This would be a good, um, good Halloween look, right? Oh no! Uh, thank you all again. Live your best life, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye, cause I'll keep talking.